I know that our, our vendor was planning to meet me tomorrow at 2 o'clock if the shipment had come in. So I'll be at the dojo from 2 to almost 9 o'clock tomorrow night. So hopefully it'll come in at some point. Yeah. So. Well, we'll be here tomorrow night for the kids. Uh, yeah, <laughs> so I can torture them with endurance class. Awesome. All right, well, we're going to get started, young lady. Let's face front. Show them bow. Puss. And guess who gets to bow us in? You. All right. Fantastic. Let's stand up. All right, here we go. Let's put our thumbs in our belts and let's wiggle our toes. Each, ni, san, chi, go, ru, chi, hach, ku, ju. Pick your right leg up. Let's circle. Each, ni, san, chi, go. Change directions. Each, ni, san, chi, go. And shake it out. Very good. Left leg up and circle. Each, ni, san, chi, go. Go, change directions, each, ni, san, chi, go, and shake it out. Feet together, hands on your knees, let's circle. Each, ni, san, chi, go, change directions, each, ni, san, chi, go. And step out shoulder width, let's go down and up. Each, ni, san, chi, go. Rook, shich, hach, ku, ju. Okay, make those legs wider, and we're going to stretch to your left. Here we go, ichi. Ni. And sun. Another way, ichi. Ni and some. And each. Ni. Sun. And each. Ni. And sun. And let's sit all the way down, extending your left leg, bending your right knee. Let's stretch to your left leg. Each, ni, san, shi, go, ruk, shi, hach, ku, ju. Twist your bent knee. Each, ni, san, shi, go, ruk, shi, hach, ku, ju. Change your legs. And reach out and stretch to your right leg. Each, ni, Sun, shi, go, ruk, shi, hach, ku, ju, and twist to your bent knee. Each, ni, sun, shi, go, ruk, shi, hach, ku, ju. Let's spread those legs out into a V. We're gonna go two counts to the left and two counts right. Ichi, ni, sun, shi, go, ruku. Shichi, hachi, ku, ju, and give it a little twist. Now two counts to your right first. Ichi, ni, san, shi, go, ruku, shichi, hachi, ku, ju. I love warm nights like this because I feel extra stretchy on nights when I'm not so stretchy. All right, let's walk our hands out. Ichi, ni, san, Chi, go, ruk, chi, chi, hach, ku, ju, and hold it. Come on back. Bring the bottoms of your feet together. Let's rock on our sokuto. Ich, ni, san, chi, 
Press down on those knees. You give them a gentle shake and let's stand up in the Kibarachi. So give yourself a nice strong horse stance. Good. Little rock left and right. And straighten those legs, hands behind your head. Let's walk our feet in. Ichi. Ni, Sun, Shi, Go, Rook, Shit, Hatch, Ku, Toes are touching, Gu, Heels are touching, and reach up as high as you can. Palm heels to the ground. Ichi, ni, san, shi, go, ruk, shi, hach, ku, ju. Grab your ankles, bring your head to your knees. Bend those knees and slowly stand up. Put your thumbs in your belt. Let's move our heads up and down. Ichi, ni, san, shi, go, ruk, shi, hach, ku, ju. Side to side. Ichi, ni, san, shi. Let's circle. Each. Ni. San. Shi. Go. Other way. Each. Ni. San. Shi. Go. And shrug those shoulders forward. And shrug them back. And hands up for gasho. Each. Ni. Sun. Now hands up and press those fingers together as hard as you can. And shake them out. Roll those wrists forward and roll them back. And pull your right foot in. Nare. Let's face front. Show them and bow. Oops. And please face here and bow. Oops. Okay, so now you're going to have to balance on one leg. You're going to balance on your left leg. So you're going to pick your right leg up. And we're going to do Mai Kiyage Hiri. Do not touch the floor. And then to Seiken Agozuki. So Mai Kiyage Hiri. So no knee bend. Straight leg kick. And then two four fish strikes to the chin. Right, so Ichi. Knee. Chi. Go. Ha. Good. Change your feet. Hot. I love trying to balance on carpet. It's so challenging. Ready? Here we go. Same thing, but now we're going to punch left, right, left leg kick. Ready? Ichi. Knee. Sun. Chi. Go. Huh. Yeah. Good. All right. Put that down. So you're about to get my drift of where we're headed. Right leg in the air again. Now, Kingeri. Kingeri. Straight ahead. And then to Yaraken Shomenuchi. So knee up. Try to get it as high as you can. Toes down. All right. So Ichi. Knee. Sun. Shi. Oh, I lost track. Go. Huh. Oh, I lost my balance as well. Lovely challenge we have going on. Okay, left leg up. Tighten our core. Ready, so Ichi. Knee. Sun. Shi. Go. Huh. Yeah. All right. Next one. Maigiri Mawashigiri. So Maigiri Mawashigiri, both to the front, not front and side. So we're going to be Maigiri Mawashigiri, 
Sayuchi, two times. Okay, so now, the tricky part is making sure that on your front kick, your toes on the supporting foot are facing forward. On your roundhouse kick, your toes turn sideways. Then they have to turn back. And then we throw our, our, kick, our punches. All right, easy peasy, <laughs> ready? Here we go, Ichi, front kick, round kick, come back, and Sayuchi, Sayuchi, good thing. Knee. There you go, you got it. Sun. She. One more time. Go. Okay, so now our left leg is up, left front kick, round kick, and then left sayuchi, right sayuchi. Ready? Ichi. And you may find one leg balances better than the other. Knee. Sun. When I remember to engage my core, I am far more balanced than when I forget that I have connections here. She. You might have that fun same experience. Go. Ha. All right. You know, we have one more to do, right? Ken Setsuguri Yokuguri. But this one, we're going to just do to the side and then Furuyuchi. All right, so you're gonna to kick towards the couch or kick towards the window, but we're gonna start out with our right leg going towards your couch. Okay, so ichi. And right side, left side. Good, knee. Sun. Shi. So you're getting there, good. Go. That was my premature excitement of being done with that. <laughs> All right, left leg, here we go. Ready, ichi. Left hand on top. Knee. Sun. Shi. Go. All right, good, all right, put that down. Uh, give your hips a little uh, circle or so because you might feel a, a little fatigue in the, the core, lower core region. All right, let's get down for push-ups. So tonight you have a choice. Gasho, Koken, or 10 finger prints for the first 10 push-ups. So Gasho, Koken, or 10 finger prints. Are you ready? I'm going to do 10 fingerprints. Get set and begin. Ichi, ni, san, shi, go, rek, shich, hach, ku, yu. Good. All right. So now your next 10, you have a choice of your seiken touching or right fist only for five and left fist only for five. If you choose right fist only and left fist only, you may use your knees. All right, so I'm gonna choose right fist only for five. Now what I do is I usually put my other wrist, uh, uh, my other hand wraps around my wrist for extra support so that my wrist doesn't bottom out on me. Ready, ichi, knee, sun, Chi, go, and change hands if you have a single hand. Rook, shit, hot, ku, ju, and sit back. Whew. All right. So now you're gonna do thirty crunches. Every ten, do a new crunch um, style. But you're gonna do it on your own count, 30 crunches. 
and begin. Okay, so if you need to take a second to get some water or stretch a little bit or not. I didn't bring my water, but Annalise is going to the recipe for me. That is awesome that Annalise is helping you out. She came running down the steps. She must have heard you say water. No yes, water that's a good daughter you got there. Sassy and all. So you're going to need a pillow and you're going to be able to, I want you to be able to put your hand on that couch. So you're going to put the pillow on the floor. You're going to put your knee on the pillow, one hand on the couch and the other foot knee. So put your right knee on the pillow and put your left foot flat. So we're gonna work on lifting our knee up for a Yoko Gary. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna bring our leg up, kick out to the side, and bring it back. So our idea is we're trying to engage the lower core, we're trying to lift from the knee. All right, we're also gonna to try to make our big toe up, little toes down. And we're gonna to try to come up, out, back and down, just five times, but really focus on lifting the knee not the heel okay so here we go so ichi yes knee engage that core sun she and one more time go yeah good now I'm going to just face the opposite direction because we've got to use the other leg. So if you would like to use your other couch, if that'll help, or just facing the opposite direction, you choose. You just use that leg, so you have to, yes, ma'am. We don't want one leg to be strong and the other leg to be not quite as strong. Put that right foot flat. All right, so you're gonna kick right at me at the screen and I'm gonna kick right at you. All right, so ichi. Knee, lift up from the knee. Sun. Chi. Go. Yeah. Yeah. And stand up, please. Okay. So why did we spend that time doing that? Well, because we want to be able to make sure we pick our knee up. Because what we're going to do is we're going to work on crossover side kicks. You remember crossover side kicks? A little. All right, well, that's why we're going to do it. So we're both going to face that way. Okay? And what we're going to do is, hmm, tell you what, I'll go in the same direction as you. Maybe that'll make it easier. So you and I are going to go towards your screen. I'm going to step away from your screen as you come towards the screen. So we've got our right leg behind us. We're going to start this time around with the right leg stepping behind us. So step behind. Now lift that knee up high, kick, and then come back out. Yes. Knee, step behind, lift, kick. And let's that direction. Yes, ma'am. You're kicking. And I'm just going to scoot back so I can get one more repetition in. So really try to keep your eyes forward though on your target. Don't let your look out, don't look at your back shoulder, look at your front shoulder. Or in the kicking direction. Sun, step behind. I'm just turning my face so I can see you. Good. All right. Now we're gonna go the other way. So we're still facing this wall. Now you're gonna step away from the screen. 
So you're not going to look at me. You're going to look over your right shoulder in the direction you're kicking. Are you going to let leg up back? Yes, ma'am. Ready? So pick your left leg, step behind. Pick your right leg up and kick. Ichi. Yes. I love how you brought your knee up high. Let's do it again. Knee. And if you have room to do one more time without kicking your couch, try to kick over your couch. Sun. Yeah. Good. Okay. Change direction. So now I'm just going to watch you. And you're going to go a little bit faster. Crossover side kick. It's cross behind technically because you're bringing your leg behind you. Ready? And I want you to give me a nice strong side kick. Ready? Ichi. Yes. I love that chamber. Do it again. Knee. Yes. Now try to pull your big toe up a little bit more so that your ankle makes the letter L. And sun. Yes. Good. Now you're going the other way just three times. Ready? Ichi. Knee. And sun. Good, so and all right. So now we're gonna give you a I like it's a fun kick combination that in, incorporates a spinning back kick and a cross behind side kick. Alright, so in your fighting stance, your back leg is gonna do a front snap kick. So ichi and leave it up front. Your back leg is now gonna do a roundhouse kick, knee. This is where the cross behind side kick comes in. Sun, cross the right leg behind and side kick. Good, now I'm gonna face in the same direction as you so we can do this together. Take your left heel, point, pick your right leg up. Do a straight back kick and then turn in the direction of your kick. Nope, that's the opposite direction of your kick. So kick. Kick with the right leg, and then turn to your right. Yes! And left knee kick, and right jumping knee kick, where you just go up, half. So let me show you what that looks like. So you did a knee kick, and then a jumping knee kick is you're just gonna swing that back leg in the air. All right, shall we try it again? Yeah, I'm gonna move back so that I have more movement. Absolutely, go back as far as you need to be. So I'm gonna face in the same direction as you, so we're gonna do a left front snap kick, ichi. Right roundhouse kick, knee. Cross behind side kick, san. Turn that heel towards the screen. Look over your left shoulder. Bring your left leg up and kick, chi. Kick behind, do a straight back kick, and turn towards your left. Knee kick, go. And jumping knee kick, rook, yeah. Yes. All right, shall we try it again? Okay, but I'm not gonna do it because I wanna watch you do it. So fighting stance, front foot, front, front snap kick, ichi. Now roundhouse kick, knee. Cross behind side kick, sun. All right, so now turn that front foot so your heel is pointing towards me, pick your left leg up kick and keep turning to your left. Yes, right knee kick, go. Left jumping knee kick and kiai. Yeah. Good, all right. Now I see you do all one count. Ready, set, begin. Front kick, round kick, cross behind side kick, back kick, turn to your left kick. Keep turning to your left. Right knee kick, left jumping knee kick. Yeah! Fantastic! Alright, so something to add to your repertoire of fun. So, any questions about that combination? No, I don't think so. Good. Yoi. Stepping into a right sun chindachi. Come on, Kay. Put your left hand up, right hand in chamber for Yarakin Mawashiuchi. Yarakin Mawashiuchi. Do you remember which one this is? 
Yep, but we gotta use both hands. So let's break it down. So one, two, three. And make sure you have a nice strong chamber on the left side. We don't want our hand tucking behind us. We want a nice chamber. One, two, three. Good, so we're gonna do 10 single strikes. Okay, so Ichi, Ni, Sun, Chi, Go, Rook, Shich, Hach, Ku, Ju, Huh. Good, now circle your left foot forward into a left sun chin dachi. Remember, you circle and leave it out front. Uh-oh, sorry, I got so excited, I forgot to keep the camera awake. All right, Tetsui Uchiuchi, that inner knight uh, hammer fist. Take that right hand to your opposite ear. Ichi. Ni. Sun. Shi. Go. Rook. Shichi. Good, circle that right foot forward. Hiji mawashi ate. Hiji mawashi ate. So hiji is our elbow, and we know mawashi is roundhouse, so what will that look like? We'll do it together. One. So we start with, so ichi. Ni. Sun. Shi. Go. Rick. Shit. Hach. Ku. Ju. Okay, circle that left foot forward. Hiji ate. Hiji ate. What's the difference between hiji ate and hiji age? Here's how I remember it. Age spells age. A-G-E. And what does the number do as you age but go up? So if you hear hiji age, we're doing a rising elbow. Hiji ate is a one plane or level plane. So here in hiji ate, we're coming straight ahead. We're striking with that elbow. We're using the point of our elbow to strike to maybe someone's chest bone. Now, the one thing I want you to do is, see this is, I call skinny wrist or skinny fist and wide fist. When you do your hiji ate or your hiji age, make sure you have the thin fist, not the wide fist. Especially in the hiji age, because you end up punching yourself in the face. And then that's highly embarrassing, because then you have to explain to everybody that the bruise is because you punch yourself in the face. Okay, so hiji ate, ichi. Ni, san, shi, go, ruku, shichi, hachi, ku, ju, ha. Okay, now hiji age, so we're going up. Now, one thing I wanna add is that as you rise, you lift the heel of the foot on that side of your body. It gives you more reach. Because watch, here's without my foot off the ground. Here's with my foot off the ground. See how much higher I was able to get? Maybe not so much because of the screen, um, but it gives you a chance to get a little bit higher. So if someone's taller than you, you need to get them. You've got to lift your heel up to get higher. Okay, so Ichi, check your, make sure you have a, ah, I see. So take, yes ma'am, make sure it comes by same side. If you go across, you lose some range of motion, nice and high, ready? Knee, straight up, sun, chi, go, rick, shit, hach, ku, ju, ha. Okay, now pull your left foot in, now right? So now from ikodachi, what we're gonna do is we're gonna do those five hand techniques, but only one strike of each in a row. So first, you're rocking mawashi uchi, ready? So ichi. Now left hand tetsui uchi ni. Hiji ate, san. Hiji age, shi. 
Kijima Washiate, go. I just realized that that was not the order we practiced them in. Kijima Washiate came before Ate and Age, so let's do that again, starting with our left hand. Ichi, Yarake no Washi. Now Tetsui Uchichi, Ni. Now Kijima Washiate, San. Kiji Ate, Shi. And rising elbow, go. Yes, ma'am. One more time, slow motion. Ichi. Ni. Sun. Shi. Go. Ha. Yeah. All right, you ready to do it all one count? Okay. We're gonna go slowly. We're gonna go slowly. Um, so the important part is that we take each strike as it comes. We're going to start out with Yoraka no Washi Uchi. Ready? All one count. Begin. So Yoraka no Washi Uchi. Tetsui Uchi Uchi. Hiji no Washi Ate. Hiji Ate. Hiji Age. Good. Ni. One. Two. Three. Sun. One, two, three, four, five. She. One, two, three, four, five. All right, now close your eyes. All one count. Ready, set, go. Just put that fist on your left. Yes, ma'am. And nare. All right. So what I would like to do is I want to go over Seiro Kata number one. You feel like you know it really well. Kind of know it. Don't know it at all. Good. Well, then that's why we're going to go. Seiro Kata number one, you're drawing the upside down letter T. Right? So your first opponent is always to your left. Always to your left. So your left hand up, up your right hand down. You're going to turn to your left. Make sure, so one thing, uh, Misty, just don't pivot on your feet. What you really want to do, and I'm going to show you from this angle, if, if I were going in this direction, my, and I'm, this is my left, my first move, look how I slide my heel so that I have a strong stance. Right, so when you, when you do that first move, I want you to draw your heel towards your lamp in that back corner. That way, when you turn towards the window, you're going to be in a wide enough and a strong enough front leaning stance. All right, so I'm going to face you. So I'm mirror opposite of you. Right now, it's left hand up, right hand down. Turning to your left. Ichi, turn and lock down, punch middle. Just make that a little more, look like a little more middle. Yes, ma'am. Knees, like both punch face. Put that left hand down, put your right hand up, we have to sweep our front foot. Sun, bring your front foot behind you, lock down, and punch middle. Chi, slide forward, punch face. Now you're coming towards the screen, put your right hand down, left hand up, go, turn and block down. Roku, slide forward, punch middle. Chi Chi, slide forward, punch middle. Hachi, slide forward, punch face, Kiai, cut. So now, this is where we trace backwards on our letter T. So hug your left hand on the bottom. Slide your right leg back, inside block. Koo. Okay. Make sure that hand comes on the outside. Don't let it get stuck on the inside. So hug your, yes. Now right outside block. Ju. Cross your left hand in front. Jwichi, face block. Your other left hand. Now you're turning left. This time you're going to block down, punch down. So left hand to your ear. Chusun, lock down and punch down. Jushi, side forward, punch middle. Okay, put that left hand down, right hand up to your opposite ear. Jugo, sweep behind you. Lock down and punch down. And punch middle, kiai. Jurok, pull that front foot back. Cross that left hand on the outside and block down. Okay, one thing I want to just take a minute to correct because um, 
We want to catch it early. Junchian Gail and I, they didn't point it out to us until we were going up for a sandan. So we had lots of years of experience and we were doing it incorrectly. The inside block. Make sure that when you do that inside block and your arms are parallel, make sure that the bottom hand clears on the outside of the upper arm. Don't kind of cross in front. So make sure it sticks out and comes up. Yes, ma'am. So what you can do is drop your elbow down at the same time. Yes, ma'am. Okay, let me see you do it with your right hand. Yes, yes. So really when you do that inside block for now, just really take it slowly and really focus on making sure you clear that way. You ready to do it one more time, Seder one? All right, good. Yoi. All right, so now I'm just gonna watch you because I wanna see what you can retain on your own. Okay, make sure that left heel slides towards your lamp. Ichi. And punch middle. Knee. Yes, it's going the opposite direction. Sun. And punch middle. Chi. Good, now you're coming towards me. Go. Rook. Shich. Hotch. Yeah. Good, going straight back. Ku. Yes, ma'am. Ju. Twitchy. Ah. Cross that left hand in front. Make it a left face block. Yes. Now you're going to your left. Ju sun. And punch down. Yes. Ju shi. Nope, that's a middle one. Yeah, that's where it gets tricky remembering the order. Going the opposite way. Ju go. Lock down, punch down. And ju rook. Big kiai. And nare. Okay, so I'm not sure if this will be helpful to you, but what I what I have to remember is when I begin Seder 1, I'm at one level, and I finish Seder 1, and I'm at one step down. So if you're a musical person, it's one octave lower, maybe? I don't know. I'm not a musical person. All I know is I start out with block down, punch middle, and I have to finish with block down, punch down. So I have to take one step down. Like maybe I'm going down the steps to the basement or something. I don't know, but that's how I have to remember it. I'm not sure if that can help you, but. Yeah, Senpai Jen, she, she did this Wednesday in the Roto, and she tried helping me remember it that way too. I just, I think I just need to really like, almost like say it out loud a few times to help myself to remember. I totally understand. Yeah. I totally understand. Any questions before we finish tonight? No, I don't think so. All right. Well, thank you. What is the difference between ate and age? That's one. Yeah, so age is rising. Ate is one level. That's why it's hiji mawashi ate, because it stays at one level. If it was hiji mawashi age, it would like come up and over. Does that make sense? So, age is rising, ate is one level. All right, fantastic. Well, guess who gets to bow us out? Yes! Awesome, let's face front and show my bow. Oops. And let's kneel down, please. And please do us the honor. Oops. Thank you so much for joining me this evening. I would have been one lonely Jun Shihan if you didn't.